Coming up next, we get to a featherweight tilt between Max Holloway and Conor McGregor. So here is Conor McGregor making the walk once again, and to say he has put Dublin, Ireland on the MMA map has got to be the understatement of the century. McGregor has vaulted into superstardom, former UFC featherweight champion, UFC lightweight champion, the only simultaneous two-division champion, and has become the biggest superstar mixed martial arts has ever seen in UFC history. Conor McGregor has that it factor, along with a fantastic and creative striking game, a very good ground game, and extreme confidence in himself. All these make for a fan favorite combination. So here is the undisputed UFC featherweight champion, Max Holloway, won the interim belt from Anthony Pettis and then unified the belt with a win over Jose Aldo in Brazil. That was his 11th in a row. Remarkable what Max Holloway has accomplished, still just 25 years of age, and he has ably taken the torch for Hawaii from BJ Penn. Max blessed Holloway, one of the best pound-for-pound -pound fighters of the world. This guy has world-class takedown defense. He is incredibly difficult to take down, and once you do get him down, he gets back to his feet very swiftly. for this, our main event of the evening. Holloway is 26, McGregor is 29. He will have a five inch reach advantage. All right, now for the official introductions, the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliata. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 21 wins, three losses. He stands 5 feet 9 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting at a Dublin Island, the notorious Connor McGregor! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the right corner. This man is a boxer, holding a professional record of 19 wins, 3 losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Wyandotte, Hawaii, Max Bruce Holloway! All right, give me the rules of the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. They touch gloves and we are underway. You ready? You ready? Let's go. Here we go. Well, with that patented Hawaii toughness and as much self belief as any fighter. Oh! about that chin. And now start to snap off that chin. Wow! He's got him hurt here. Big shots! Ooh. Spinning back fist. Big straight punch. Vicious, vicious punch 
combinations here. And he's going to try to take the back. Well, just because you're on your back doesn't mean you can't throw offense. Staying busy here. You like to see that, Joe. Perfectly timed sweep. Very nice sweep winds up in his guard. McGregor gets back up again. Fainting with that kick. Well, some have gotten through, Joe. This shot is blocked. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. He tagged him again. Oh! He's hurt. Wow! Oh! And just like that, the fight is over. Beautiful, accurate uppercut for the KO. Yeah, Joe, a near-perfect strike to end the fight and end the night for his opponent, who candidly may not have even seen that shot coming. So just the way he drew it up, exactly what he told us during fight week played out here on fight night. He found a little opening in his opponent's defense and barged right through it to get the big knockout win. And let's look at that from another angle. Well, hard to perform much better than he did tonight. A huge knockout under the lights. They'll be talking about that one for some time. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliotta is going to stop in this contest at 1 minute, 40 seconds of the very first round. He's playing the winner by knockout, the notorious Conor McGregor! So the notorious Conor McGregor getting it done yet again. I am running out of superlatives when it comes to describing all this man has accomplished. People have doubted him. He mutes every naysayer every step of the way. And again, it doesn't seem to matter the challenge. They said the wrestler would be his kryptonite. The striker had too much power. Conor McGregor finds a way on fight night when the lights are the brightest to get the job done. And once again...